Hey friend. So recently I've had a whole bunch of people come up to me and just not like out of the blue, but conversationally or whatever, say that they felt like they needed to get some wide legged jeans. And I think, well, maybe. Uh, so I'm Rebecca Milkey and I'm a style strategist. And in my programs, all these questions uh, relate to your style DNA. And that's how we answer any questions like that. And I get that, um, you know, people like to stay uh, current with the trends. And um, so I'm 100% not against wide-legged jeans. I have wide-legged jeans. And, um, but they don't have to be for everybody. There's so other solutions. So, but I wanted to come on here and make a video about what I see as the, the real problem with wide-legged jeans, and I have a simple solution, a simple hack for solving that. So the real problem, I think, with uh, wide-legged jeans is that they're not as flexible in length. The thing that was magic about skinnies is you could puddle them, you could roll them, you could cut them off. They worked with any shoe. They look good with heels. They look good with boots. They, you could tuck your jeans into your boots so they could be ankle boots or knee high boots. I mean, they were fine with any shoe. You have to be a lot more precise with wide legged jeans. They just need to be the right, the right length. And I remember, you know, being like in high school and that was the thing we were wearing. And you would, in the winter time, you would just walk around with your jeans wet halfway up your leg because it's snowing or whatever, and, or it's raining. And um, so anyway, so the old school solve for this was that you would just buy two pairs of the identical jeans. This is what stylists have been saying for years. And you would hem one to wear with, like flats, and you would hem the other one to wear with heels. And that can definitely work. If that is a strategy that works for you and you like that, that is great. The proportion is a thing that that solve doesn't take into consideration. So the thing with um, why I don't like to always wear wide-legged jeans is because my legs are a little bit short. And this is lots of us. You know, unless you're that person that already looks like your legs are, like you're wearing heels if somebody sees you and you're wearing flats, unless your legs are that long, wide-legged jeans are gonna make them look a little bit shorter. And so I think the magic solve for now, the modern solution is to cut them off um, around ankle or crop length, whatever works for you. So if, you, if your pants are a little bit short, it sort of fools the eye into thinking that your legs are a little bit long. So if you have short legs like me, then this crop length, and it's just, it looks modern. Then take and fringe it a little bit. You just take a little pin and pull out some of the crossways threads and make it look a little bit soft and fringy at the bottom. Okay, so here I have to insert that I am in almost Idaho, USA. If you are somewhere else, this may not be modern looking to you. But here, it's, it works. And it's, you still see this look in the stores and everything. Um, also, because I am in actually Spokane, Washington, if you've seen on the news recently about the fires that we're having here, I want you to know that I'm okay. And also that it's raining. It's been raining really hard today. Thank you, Jesus. Um, so anyway, last week I mentioned that I'm opening up a handful of coaching one-on-one -on -one spots and I still can um, do one or maybe two more. So if this is something that you feel like would help you to um, 
make your wardrobe work for you, uh, send me a message. I'd love to hop on a call and talk strategy with you. Thanks for watching.